guys what's up it's noelle welcome back to my channel so today's video is we are making cookies we're baking them we're going to decorate them um they have to chill for an hour or two so obviously we'll film the whole process my mom is actually scheduling like a zoom cookie thing tonight so it's perfect timing if you guys don't already follow me on the instagram on the instagram on instagram uh, it's always linked down below as well as my nursing video playlist So go make sure you guys check that out without further ado. Let's get started I already prepped all the ingredients just because that says boring Flour without trying to spill it. This is flour baking powder and salt in here. I have sugar in this bowl um, I have the butter and the eggs that I need to mix up and then I cannot forget the vanilla because I haven't That's the only thing I haven't added and I know I'm gonna forget it. So make sure I don't forget it yeah, what am I waiting for? Let's just get started. All right, I'm going to set you guys there so you guys can kind of see what I'm doing. Um, I'm going to cream together the sugar, butter, and eggs right now. Do you guys see this? The egg is like stuck inside of this carton. <gasps> Okay. All right, I'm adding the vanilla. I love vanilla. Vanilla smells so good. Oops. Oh. Extra vanilla don't hurt nobody. All right, this is the consistency I have right now. I gotta beat this until it's smooth and then I will add the dry ingredients. The batter finally looks creamy. It smells so good. So I'm just gonna add this and then put it out on a baking sheet. Now for the fun part, I get to roll it out. I'm gonna cover this baking sheet with plastic wrap. And then after I roll it out flat, I'm gonna put it in the fridge to chill for like an hour or two. And then we can make the cookies. We will be using this as a rolling pin. Right, these are the finished products i'm going to let this cool and then i'll be back i'm in the closet so justin won't hear me but my whole prank idea from my last video that i couldn't mention because he was right there is that i'm gonna bake two sets of cookies each for a different amount of time so one will be a little more like gooey and chewy and one will be a little more crunchy and then i'm gonna ask him to see if he can tell the difference and basically play it off as like one is store-bought and one isn't however he was just in the kitchen so if he's observant he saw that there was no store-bought cookies and I'm making them all homemade. So not really a prank. Um, it's just kind of like a taste test, I guess. I don't know. I don't really like prank videos, so this is not really a prank. It's just, can you tell the difference? But there really is no difference. It's just a fun little twist on baking cookies. This is also my first time making sugar cookies from scratch by myself, so I'm impressed. It was very easy. Also, I went to two different stores looking for cookie cutters and Neither of the stores had them, so we're just going to go with kind of circular, and then we'll draw on the designs. I bought frosting, we have some sprinkles, so I think that part's going to be fun. Maybe Justin will decorate one of them with me. I don't know, he's working. That's the whole video idea, that's the whole secret, it's not really that crazy. I'm just, that's, that's, that's a prank for me, so. Alright guys, I am back. It's been about an hour and a half, almost two hours. It's time to get cooking, cutting, cutting cookies. Um... I will link the recipe that I'm using down below. It's from Sally's Baking Addiction. Um, preheated the oven to 350 and then we're just gonna bake them. And that's how you do it, ladies and gents. Our big baking sheet is currently dirty and I don't feel like cleaning it. So we're gonna use a small one and the medium one. It doesn't even look like we have that many cookies anyway. 
So this seems like it'll work out. Someone comment down below the science of cooling the cookies before you cook them because I've never really done that until now just because it seems like, I don't know, unnecessary. But I have washed my hands, washed my hands earlier too, just to clarify, um, clean the counter. So even though these are on Saran Wrap anyway, I'm gonna spray these with Pam and then put them in the oven. Comment down below what kind of cookie is your favorite cookie. I am a chocolate chip gal, I have to say. I don't like things that are too sweet, so like sometimes sugar cookies are just too sweet and I'm not about it. Christmas time and decorating, like you really only decorate sugar cookies, so. Oh, also gingerbread cookies. Ooh, actually Justin mentioned that the other day and we wanted them, however, we couldn't figure out where to get them. Starbucks didn't have them and we didn't feel like going to a bakery. Anyway, Pam, I never use this until Justin introduces to me, but it's very convenient. I might try to do like a snowman or like a tree, but it also might turn out horribly. So we'll see. I have different size circles here because that's kind of the only thing that I have around the house to use as cutters. Alright, so these are the cookies that I have right now. Um, I'm going to finish these while these bake in the oven, but I tried my best to make little designs without cookie cutters. So I'm going to put these in the oven and then we'll see how they turn out. It says to put them in for 11 to 12 minutes. However, I don't know if I did the right thickness for that time. So I just put them in for 8 minutes because obviously you can always cook them longer and you can't take back the heat that you gave the cookies and burn them. So that's what we're doing. Cookies are looking good. They don't look done yet, so I'm gonna put them in for a little longer. All right, so the first batch of cookies is out. The shapes actually did pretty well. Snowman's a little flat on that side, but that's okay. And then once he's cool, I'm gonna put these ones in. Baby, I want you to try the um, cookies in a sec. The store-bought ones are in the uh, oven right now, and then the other ones I'm homemade are out, so I want to see if you can tell a difference. Guys, we only have two more days on our advent calendar. Look how full this tree is. Also, you guys probably saw this in the background, but we got this huge bag of chocolate from my Auntie Linda, so shout out to you. Thank you so much. Put it in this bowl, and now we got chocolate galore. And she also gave us hot chocolate from Ghirardelli, which is how you're supposed to pronounce it, not Ghirardelli. But comment down below, are you a dark chocolate or a milk chocolate type of person? We also just ordered some buns, some beef. Beef and pork buns. If you've never had them, try them. Last batch of cookies is coming out of the oven right now. Okay, the other ones need to cook for like a minute, but we have these ones here that have cooled off. Okay, so we have homemade here and um, What's it called? Store-bought here. So I'm going to have Justin try one of each. Well, I just one of each. No, my little tree thing fell off. My tree stump fell off. I just have this like cookie icing already in this like squeeze bottle thing. So I just have to take this. Oh, oh. Uh, I got to cut them right. Always got to start at the smallest cutting point. I know it's not the cutest, guys, but it's just so he can try it. We'll spend more time on the other ones. But not the ones that I eat. <laughs> That's some priorities right there. No, I, I would say this is pretty cute. I don't know how much icing you like. Look, that's pretty cute, right? Also, these have to cool a little more to ice them, so. All right, here's the finished cookie. Not the cutest, but I tried, you know? 
We'll try this one. We'll do a little stripey stripe. All right, there is the other one Justin is going to try. All right, babe. Is it time? It's time. Okay. I'm excited. This is my first time making homemade cookies, so hopefully they compare. Okay, circle is homemade. This one is store bought. Wait, what? <laughs> homemade. <laughs> Take my Why would you tell me which ones? Oh, Frank! <laughs> okay, go away for a second. What? I'm gonna have to redo it. I just messed up. <laughs> oh, shoot! <gasps> Frank! I forgot about my other cookies! See, this is what happens when I get distracted. You ready now? Yeah, we're good. Ready. Everything These all two. right here? You guys need help? <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah. Are you guys all right? Oh gosh. Okay. okay. Liking the experience? Okay. I like your little swirl. Thanks. Okay. So I just which ones do I? I just. You just taste them. Just taste them all. Yeah. Now these there, two. These two. Okay. Taste them. Tell and, them what you think. Okay. All right. I'm gonna try this one first. Hold on. Come on. Come on. Come on. You gotta cover your face. <laughs> Look at that, it's nice. Alright. I haven't even tried these, so I'm hoping they're good. Mmm. Okay, so. <laughs> what do you rate it? I rate it tasty. It's delicious, but, um. <laughs> okay. So, do you need water or something? What, like cleanse my palate? Mm hmm. I want to say that this one's a store-bought one. Why Wait, you actually, I want to say that. Wait. I want to say that one's store-bought. Why? I have no idea. Okay. Okay, and then you have this one. <laughs> no, you're Come like, on. Hey. Come on. Hey, there you go. Nice swirl. Okay, I'm going to try this one. Mmm. <laughs> Alright, this one's definitely better. <laughs> Alright, this one <laughs> Does that mean it's store bought this or one, not? <laughs> this must mean it's store bought. Maybe! <laughs> from your from your face. <laughs> but they're both really good. So that's your final verdict. Look, baby, I'll eat this one too. Mmm! <laughs> <laughs> So that's your final verdict. The first one was mine, and the second one was store bought. Matter of fact, this one's actually tasting a little bit better now. Now that I eat it a second time, now that I get back into it, <laughs> this one's actually a lot better. Why would I want to eat this anyways <laughs> when I can eat this? <laughs> it's so much better. Mm. <laughs> yep. Is this store bought? This one was so good. Is this store bought? Did you buy it? <laughs> it is so good. It's almost like I went to Kroger and bought and ate that. You made that? <laughs> My gosh. Good job. That's amazing. <laughs> That's great. I could have never have known. Alright. Wait, no, baby. I need to tell you something. <laughs> what happened? Are they all yours? Yeah. God damn it. <laughs> it worked. I'm gonna lie to. <laughs> Guys, that is my cookie Christmas prank. Oh, Christmas man. cookie prank. Christmas cookie prank. I should have known better because we have the same fridge. There was no store bought cookies in the fridge. So you were in the kitchen earlier, and I was yeah. like, I hope he doesn't notice. Yeah, I was thinking because I was like, you didn't, you didn't buy any <laughs> any cookies. And I'm an idiot. <gasps> Woo! It worked! I'm not <laughs> Thank you. Play the game on me, dude. <laughs> oh my gosh. That was perfect. Okay, so I'm gonna let the rest of these cookies cool and then we will get to decorating them.
little Santa. I know he's looking a little weird, but I had to cut that out myself. Little star tree, 2020 ornament, candy cane. Still got a lot of cookies to decorate, but I will do that a little later. All right, guys, that's it for the video. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys were able to make your own holiday cookies or decorate them or at least eat them this year. Um, I had a lot of fun making these for the first time. I had fun pranking Justin. And yeah, I hope you guys just enjoyed this. So if you did, give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell for notifications. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.